Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Toasty and today we are back with another Final Fantasy Brave Exodus video and today we are taking on the Armor of Oppression, the big iron giant. Uh, we're gonna bring Zargabath as our buffer. We're also gonna bring Aiko as our healer slash summoner because we need to summon an Esper in that fight. Uh, Link's gonna be our breaker just for fun. Warrior of Light, 100% evade tank and the two main damage dealers miss fravia right here we're gonna try to do a lot of damage with these two girls right here so first turn we're gonna use zargabat we're gonna use arcadian light we're of light we're gonna make sure that he basically uh covers for the whole party that's gonna be really really important and uh, right here we're just gonna make sure that our uh our evil gauge will uh get a little bit more uh will get a little bit more filled up right off the bat uh first turn we're also going to break the attack and magic. That's one thing that always make sure when you're doing this fight. Keep that ma uh, that attack and magic broken. Because the magic is going to do a lot of damage with it. Since he's going to cast Meteor every single turn. So you have to be careful with that. Uh, he has low spirit. So that's one thing that uh, Freya is really good at. Since he has lower spirit. You can do a little bit more damage to him. Uh, right here we took a lot of damage. Basically good thing we broke the uh, magic. Or else we would have died on this turn. Uh, right here, we're going to cast Word of Law on the second turn just to mitigate the damage that we're going to be taking. Uh, we're going to use Brave Presence just for fun with Warrior of Light because there's nothing else to do right now. Uh, dual White Magic. We're going to... You know what? Actually, I, th I, think, I think we can make it happen with just this one right here. Crypto Performance. We're going to heal. Uh, we're going to break his defense and spirit. And we should be able to pass the first threshold right now. I think we should be able to pass it. I don't think it's going to be a problem. So let's go boom, boom, boom. Fravia, still too strong. Oh, that's a lot of damage. All right, so we passed the first threshold. Thankfully, we didn't pass the second threshold, which is at 50, uh, at 60%. So we were kind of lucky right here. I want to make sure that my Esper Gauge will get filled out to the max just before we cast uh, Bahamut as a chain finisher. Uh, this basically turn three is already at 67%. So we're gonna go nice and damage with the nice and easy with the damage. So we're gonna do this right here. See how much damage we're doing. We're doing a lot of damage, so we have to be careful with that. We're gonna go with hurt now. See how much damage we're doing. Is he gonna go under 60? Mm, he's just barely at 60. Alright. Uh, on this turn. We're going to cast Rejuvenate on uh, Zargabath. I want to make sure he doesn't run out, of, uh, run out of MP. That's going to be the main thing. And on this turn, we're going to cast Light is with us one more time. Ling, you're going to break the attack and magic. And Aiko, this turn, you're going to do a white magic. Uh, Karaga, I think should be the best thing, right? Do I have a lot of HP? Uh, she's pretty low. They're pretty low. So yeah, we're going to dual cast white magic. Just to be sure that we're going to survive on this turn. Uh, if you have a Fravia, well, it makes the fight a little bit easier, or else just use a Fravia fan. And if you guys have Reagan now, you can actually do um, Ice Damage. Well, just, you know, give him an Ice Sword. Uh, the Ice Brand, I think it's Attack 33 and has Ice Element on it, so it's better than nothing. Just to be able to chain with Fravia, you're going to do a little bit less damage, but still having that 75% imperil from her will make it that much easier. So, uh, now turn... Four. We're gonna go nice and easy. I want to build my gauge for next turn. Uh, I want to see he's still broken defense spirit all this good stuff We're gonna break his defense and spirit this turn. We're gonna make sure that this stays down. We're gonna do regular attacks just to make sure that uh, We don't pass another threshold and he basically goes rampage on us uh, this turn We might cast light is with us just for fun just to always make sure we have this and I want to say if we are... Do we still have reduced damage? Uh, yeah, right here. Alright, so we're going to cast Arcadian Light on turn 4. Just to make sure that we have it one more time. Next turn we should be able to do a lot of damage. So I want to try to get him as close as possible to 50%. So we're going to see what we can do right here. Alright, this is not bad at all. Alright, so. Uh, let's see. Alright. 
We have reduced damage, which is really, really good. We're going to try this right here. Frost Flower Blitz. Frost Flower Blitz. I want to see how low I can get him before I finish him. All right, so we're going to try to nuke him down real fast. Uh, his defense and spirit is broken. All right, let's cast Bahamut. He's going to lag my game out. Oh, my God. There goes Bahamut as he's lagging the game. We're going to see how much damage we can do. All right, so that's the part where we try to nuke him down. And if we're lucky, the two Frivias, even if they die, they have a chance to stay at 1%. So we're actually pretty lucky if we survive with that. So let's see how much damage we do. 28%, not that bad. I think next turn we can probably kill him. So we're going to go here. Uh, how's our HP looking? How's our HP looking? Pretty bad. So we're just going to use uh, the pod to make sure that we can regenerate some HP for everybody. Mr. Warrior of Light is going to cast Light is with us one more time. And hopefully we're going to be able to survive that. Or the two Fravias, if they're able to survive, it's going to be really, really good. The rest, if they die, it's okay. We're going to be able to nuke him down on the next turn. How's that? Yay, they survived. All right, we're good. So let's see. All right, so he buffed himself up. We're going to go right here. We're going to use dual white magic. We're going to dispel him, uh, which is right here. We're going to dispel and we're going to heal. One, two, three. So this guy is still covering for us, which is really, really good. We're going to break the attack and magic with him. Boom. Boom. We're going to break the defense and spirit with her. Uh, ideally, if you had a limit burst by now, you'd be able to cast it. But, you know, for the sake of the video, we want to kill him as fast as possible. So we're just going to do this. And we're going to see if we can drop a lot of crystals. So if everybody's buffed up, we're going to be good to go. Everybody's buffed up. All right. Let's see the chain. Can we kill him? If we don't kill him, then we're going to be able to cast the limit burst oh we're so close to a limit burst uh, all right I want I want to make sure that everything's good so here we're good we're just gonna reduce damage so you we're gonna use word of law and actually next turn we should be able to kill him in basically seven turns if everything goes well word of law hits no dead we're healing we're still good please survive that team and we're going to be good. All right. We're going to be able to cast our limit burst right now. Good job. Good job, team. You guys did it very, very well. All right. So let's do this. We're going to go one more time. Frost Flower Blitz. Frost Flower, Fla Frost Flower Blitz. We're going to finish that chain. And we're going to get it done. Nice and easy. Done. Mr. Armor of Oppression. You are completely done, Iron Giant get out of here so let's see uh we got all the uh, all the things that's for sure we called the esper we summoned the esper we uh we we did a limit burst what's the other things let me just check online real fast uh complete the quest no items use a limit burst evoke an esper we did everything like we had to do guys if you are new to the channel please leave a like on this video subscribe for more if you find that video useful uh leave a like on it also comment down below the team that you guys use and uh i want to know exactly if this was helpful for you guys a little bit because i'm gonna try to do a little bit more of those guys thank you so much for watching uh i'll catch you guys next time on the video uh, i'll catch you guys next time on the video i'll catch you guys next time on the next video and uh thank you so much for watching guys peace